This is the Valley Drive-In Theater as it looked just after it went out of business in 2015. The drive-in opened in 1967 and served the Waverly, Tennessee area for 48 years. The last movie I saw there was X-Men Days of Future Past. If you've never been to a drive-in theater, you're missing out. They've got a street party type vibe as moviegoers hang out by their vehicles, kids run around, and everyone strolls to the snack shack while the sun fades behind the horizon, marking the start of the movie. This is what the Valley Theater looks like today. Tennessee law requires property owners to keep vegetation growth under 12 inches, which is why the grass is freshly cut, yet the business remains closed. The Valley Drive-In was among the last movie theaters in the country to use a 35mm projector. Attending a film here was like going back in time. The Snack Shack, now a storage unit, featured old-fashioned fixtures and soda machines, and the ticket booth had a very retro look as well. And until the early 90s, the movie audio was still delivered via a speaker hung on your car door. As you leave the theater, folks, please be careful. Don't let this happen to your car. Be sure to remove the speaker before you leave. Every time I drove by this place, I felt sorry for that big, lonely screen standing ready for a new release that would never be shown again. And so, some friends and I decided to brighten that screen's life for the first time in six years. We brought along the DB Power 8500L 1080p Wi Fi movie projector that was powered by the Oops portable power station. This is the 600 watt version with two standard USB connections, a USB C connection, 12 watt cigarette type outlet, and dual 110 AC outlets. It had enough juice to power the projector for several movies. As the sun went down, we set up our new GVM video lighting system. Adam, light up my life with these GVM lights. <laughs> All right, These Canada. are really, really cool, man. They actually are really cool. They've I, got a lot of features for I didn't you know. know that you can master and slave them like, yeah. at the same time, and it's yep. wireless? Yeah, it's wireless. So basically anything we do on this one is going to do the same thing on that one because oh. we had them linked. So that's pretty oh. cool, right? Let's see yeah. some of them modes. Yeah, so there's different modes, right? So we can, like I said, we can change the uh, temperature of the light, you know, going warmer or lighter when we go into the white mm. and then we can go into our use so we can change the different colors you know oh. so you can go through the different colors of the the rainbow and then it's also got some uh, some scenes uh scenes. saved in it so oh you got there that? you got the 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 police that's the popo oh. Yeah. Oh. oh i like that it's romantic yeah what that, is this one called that's the uh candlelight uh scene candle oh can i blow out the candle you, you can try all right <laughs> That's all. Awesome. Well, this one didn't go out. Oh, you should you should blow that one out too. All right. Oh, what's this one called? This is awesome. This is the uh, disco mode. Disco. Is there something crazy going on behind us? Yeah, yeah, but don't don't look back there. Oh, okay. Light up your life with GVM lighting. Link in the description. Make sure you use it. Otherwise, you'll be very blue. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> Good evening, folks, and a hearty welcome to our drive-in theater. We have a wonderful evening's entertainment lined up for you. Then it was showtime, with the DB Power 8500L projecting The Wizard of Oz on an old but not forgotten screen. This is the best part. This is where Dorothy, have you seen this before? Mm-hmm. Okay, because she's uh, in black and white. That's not Dorothy right there. That's another actress. Oh, really? Yeah, she goes off screen. Everything was painted brown, then the Dorothy in color comes on. Oh. Isn't that cool? That is cool. Hey, see, you learned something. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for helping me resurrect this old drive-in. No problem. I'm glad we could have this uh, private screening. Yeah. <laughs> so this projector is the DB Power, what is it, RD828? RD828. RD828, there's a link in the description. I'll put a link in the description for the popcorn as well. <laughs> ah. Toto, I have a feeling we're not in Kansas anymore. Yeah, yeah. Please. Spoiler alert. <laughs> They're you're, not in Kansas anymore. You're not in Kansas anymore. <laughs> and this projector I'm really surprised with because it's, it's 1080. Yeah. And the audio on it is great. I thought we were going to have to bring an extra amp Yeah, no, or the internal audio is no, great. It, it's um, got... Great bass response. And we're, how far away from the screen do you think we are? Mm, 100 feet, maybe a yeah. little more, give or take. Yeah. Let's see what it looks like from the road with the drone. Okay. It 
Glinda. <laughs> Glinda, the good witch of the north. Glinda's hot. No, <laughs> oh, yeah? I know we're not in Kansas. Who's hotter, Glinda or Dorothy? Uh, I'm going to go with Dorothy. Really? Yeah, I don't like redheads. What is that? Glinda's totally dead, isn't she? Mm, probably. Who played Glinda? I'll put it on the screen. This is who played Glinda. And this is the year she died. And this is a picture of her looking her hottest. <laughs> yeah. This is how real men watch The Wizard of Oz. Yep. Let the joyous news be spread. The wicked old witch has lost his day. Thanks for watching. Hmm. Subscribe if you want to. Until next time, buh. Is, is, is he talking to us? Uh, I don't know. Uh, it's, what, is, what is he talking to you? Uh, maybe <laughs> That's you. you. Oh, uh, oh me. One of you. And bye. Thank you. <laughs> You're welcome. <laughs> All right. <laughs> I always wondered what the uh, the casting for this looked like, because you know it was back when it wasn't everything didn't have to be PC. I wonder if they just stuck up a poster and said looking for minutes. Yeah, <laughs> but you know it's so hard to find because yeah. they're so small. Yep. <laughs> We're never gonna use that. Yeah, right. I do hope somebody buys this place and fixes it up. I mean, it's ready to go. What do you think, guys? 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 Oh, you didn't leave me here. You're my ride home. What are you doing?